On an icy road nearly three years ago, a Smithville man crashed and was trapped in his car. People passing by helped save his life. KCTV5's Greg Payne spoke with the survivor who is still on a mission to find one of those good Samaritans. I've got probably three million miles on me at least. Terry Brown is no stranger to driving. For years he drove big rig trucks and not once has he ever had a vehicle accident. Other than deer strikes in the truck. But on January 6, 2017, all of that changed. I'm coming back from Quick Trip. Uh, there's a steep hill. Uh, I, I hit an ice patch. Once you hit ice, no matter what, you're just on for the ride. Brown landed right in a ditch off Amory Road in Smithville. I T-boned Earth at like 30, 35 miles an hour, they said, and just Earth didn't give it, just stopped. I T-boned it, flipped up in the air, came down. I don't know how you can drive by here and not see a car, you know? Today, Brown offered to take us to the crash spot. It definitely brings back a lot of memories. A memory of being pinned in his car for more than 40 minutes, while hearing and seeing cars continue to pass by. It sure was frustrating. I mean. 45 minutes is a long time thinking you're dying. His saving grace? I guess people couldn't see with the trees coming this way, but I just there's no way you don't see a car going that way. And I thank God Billy and Brian stopped. These two gentlemen assisted in getting help. Since the crash, Brown has met and thanked both of them. Actually, every person from the emergency responders to nurses, Brown has thanked. I thanked everybody. Billy and Brian are still communicate a lot with them. Uh, but there's two people that, without a doubt, I'm not alive. And my wife is one and the lady that first called 911. That lady arrived before Brian and Billy did, but she didn't stay on scene. But I know she had her three kids in the car. Again, with my memory, I'm not, but that's, that's just what I remember. So no idea. I, 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 I kind of remember a truck, but no idea. So for years, he's been trying to track her down, posting a number of times on social media with no success. I'm just so blessed and I'm so thankful, but uh, I'm sorry. Um, without her, yeah, I got four grandbabies that I get to see. Raw emotion, he hopes one day he can show her. I love her. I mean, really, she's, I, she's, she's, my, she's the reason I'm here. I just, there's no other thing to say. She's the most important person to me right now that, I have never met. So if you're out there watching, Terry Brown is hoping one day you'll let him say thank you. Reporting in Smithville, I'm Greg Payne for KCTV5 News. Boy, I hope he's able to meet her.